Well, the Palace Casino and Hotel in Cass Lake has been around since the early 1980s, but a new version could appear if voters pass a referendum. Haiti Clatter tells us how a vote will determine if all bets are off. Residents near the Leech Lake Reservation may soon have a new place to hit the jackpot if a referendum is approved to construct a new palace casino and hotel in Cass Lake. If it comes back uh, as a yes vote, then we're going to proceed. If it should come back as a no vote, then we've got to rethink uh, the plan. Any enrolled member of the Leech Lake Band of Ojibwe that's 18 years or older can vote on the new casino and hotel tomorrow. If the vote goes through, the casino will be located near the intersection of U.S. Highway 2 and 371. Just kind of, uh, what would that be, north of Teals on, on the same side of the Highway 2 as a government center. If built, the casino and hotel would be in this area, and buildings like the former Leech Lake Tribal Police Department would have to be demolished. There are options for what could happen to the current Palace Casino and Hotel. Maybe a college dorm for students that want to attend our tribal college there and we also talked about you know like a possible treatment facility. Michael Morris doesn't see the benefit a new casino would bring to Cass Lake, the place he's called home for 55 years. More or less it'll hurt it because the laws that they're bringing in it's going to wipe everything out. Chairman Farron Jackson Sr. says the casino can provide up to 100 jobs and also bring in tourists. Our air quality at our current Palace is not is not a is not a healthy place to have a lot of our employees working and uh, you know our clients and members that are that come to the gambling gambling establishment there. It's uh, we want to provide a a newer building. Another Cass Lake resident says he has serious concerns. This is an illegal referendum vote. Ken Mitchell says a casino serving alcohol would increase the crime in the area, and that's just part of his disapproval. They can switch the vote to any way they want but it's already been decided. They are going to build it, don't matter what we say. The cost of the casino and hotel would be between 45 to $50 million, and Chairman Jackson says the money would come from special financing. In Cass Lake, Haiti Clotter, Lakeland News. Polling stations will be open from 8 a.m. until 8 p.m. tomorrow. For a list of those stations, you can visit our website at lptv.org. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.